salvation and happiness. It's your season. It's your time. God has plans for your life to prosper you and to give you hope and a future. Join us and learn how God's love and power can bring hope and happiness to your life. This is your opportunity for motivation, encouragement, and purpose. Are you ready for motivation, inspiration, and a good time? Get ready for the Tish Barnhart Show. Real issues, relatable topics, and real people. This is your time to learn how to navigate through life's ups and downs. Get motivated as we open up about personal struggles and triumphs so you can live the incredible life you're destined to live. Just remember, God has plans for your life, plans to give you hope and a future. Victory and breakthrough are just around the corner. Now let's get ready for a brand new segment of the Tish Barnhart Show. Welcome to the show, everybody. I am Tish Barnhart, the host of the Tish Barnhart Show. Listen, we are super excited to have you guys watching with us again today. And I am super excited about our guest today. I have the CEO and founder of Daily Gospel Network, you guys, joining us today. Let's welcome George Sanders. How are you, sir? I am doing wonderful, Tish. Thank you for asking. What about yourself? I am doing fabulous, sir. I tell you, I'm so excited about us connecting again here on the show. Listen, I wanted to ask you a question. I've been on your show for uh, a couple of months now, came on in August of last year. And I must tell you, I am just so excited and happy to be here. You guys have just been so, so uh, inspirational and just so uh, welcoming to me. And I want everybody to know how great Daily Gospel Network is. So George, please Tell us today, what inspired you to start Daily Gospel Network? Well, first of all, we're happy to have you on the Daily Gospel Network. Um, What what actually inspired us was we, um, I had, uh, I have a company that uh, does marketing for businesses. Mm -hmm. And um, I actually was doing some marketing for some pastors, but for their businesses, right? Mm -hmm. And um, independently, they came in and said, hey, George, we need some help with marketing. And I said, well, I already help you with marketing. I said, no, with our churches. Now, this is two different occasions. I said, mm-hmm. you know, I don't do church. I don't, I don't do marketing for church. <laughs> and they said, well, well, you got to. Let's, what if we did some of the same things that you're helping us with our business? Right. What if you did that for our church? And I said, well, mm-hmm. you know, I've never put them to, um, to test. So I don't know if one of those things will work. Well, make a long story short, we actually implemented them for both of those churches. And those are some of the best marketing numbers I'd ever seen. Business wow. are And uh, so we started doing websites and graphics and uh, uh, I- internet marketing for churches. Mm-hmm. And it just took a life on its own. And we chose the name Daily Gospel Network. Okay. Being, of being a network of ministers and church leaders not mm-hmm. work for television and so we we i would like to say it was like uh just some inspiration from <laughs> you know <laughs> a big long story but it was uh-huh. two pastors that came in and said hey i need your help and it was already a pleasure working with them and mm-hmm. moved us into a different uh area and and we started concentrating a lot on helping ministries and uh, church leaders Wow, George. I mean, that is impressive. You know, you just started with two and then all of a sudden you just spark into this whole big network. You know, mm-hmm. what an awesome thing. What an awesome thing. And I'll tell you, you know, you are a marketing genius. Do you hear me? You are a marketing genius, George. So listen, um, I understand that right now you guys currently have a little over 400 people on the network now. Mm-hmm. Just from those two people that started. Right. Yeah. And yeah. we've sparked into it and have built this network to over 400 people. How does that feel, George? Uh, it's awesome. It's uh, it's really surreal. Um, you know, it's one of the crazy things. I, I watch the Daily Gospel Network myself. Mm-hmm. And there are times I'm sitting there and I'm watching the Daily Gospel Network and I'm saying, wow, this is a pretty cool network. And then yeah. I have to pitch myself yeah. almost like, I know these people. I, I, <laughs> I, 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 I 
and, and it's, <laughs> it's a wonderful feeling. Um, and, and just right. Well, with, I hope you're watching the Tish Barnhart show <laughs> <laughs> all the time, Tish. And you, I definitely, I'm going to watch this episode. Uh, of course, you are. <laughs> we're going to put this on replay. All right. So yes, but, but it's, it's awesome experience. Uh, you know, we have we have 400 uh, ministries and. Um, not everybody's a ministry now. So we have talked mm -hmm. to that nature, but over the past four years, we, we helped over a thousand, uh, ministry leaders that have, you know, been on the network at one point in time. Mm -hmm. And, uh, it's truly an awesome thing. And, you know, just like you and I are friends and we've gotten just over a short period of time, we've become friends. Mm -hmm. um, I've had the, the wonderful opportunity of, you know, making friends with, a lot of good men and women of God. Right. And this is, uh, that just puts, you know, the cherry on the ice cream for me. Absolutely. Absolutely. Now, George, I want to ask you this because, you know, you had started this, of course, all before the pandemic happened. And I understand that during the pandemic, you actually launched a program called Grow Your Ministry in 30 Days. Is that right? How, yes, what does that entail? Like how, how does a ministry, um, you know, take advantage of that and what does it offer them actually? Well, we, we actually, it's free. Okay. <laughs> we don't charge it's always you. good, right? Yeah. So, so <laughs> any, any pastor that's, that's listening, it's, um, it's a really, um, it's a, it's a labor of love is what it, what it is. What we've done, mm -hmm. my team and I have just put together, uh, 18, um, module video module course uh, has a workbook that comes with it and basically it shows churches how to get visibility right mm -hmm. how to be seen in whether it's your local market regionally or even nationally how to get seen because at the end of the day in order to grow your ministry you have to be seen by people right mm -hmm. and so we talk about you know in this course you know, ways to market your church so that you stand out. I mean, they're, mm -hmm. you know, not that church is a competition, but right. sometimes people get a little confused about where they should go, right? right. So you being able to uh, market your church properly and let mm -hmm. people know, you know, what, you know, what your church has to offer, what your ministry Absolutely. has to offer. And Absolutely. But I tell pastors this all the time, it, it what it does is, and make sure that you're getting the right people in your ministry. It's not that you're, yes. you're trying to, uh, you know, sift through people and say you're not right or you're not. <laughs> right. But at the end of the day, you want to serve the people that you can best help, right? right. So Absolutely. you want to make sure there may this person may be attending your church or your ministry, and they mm -hmm. may be suited somewhere else. At the end of the day, you want to protect their soul. So being at your church may not be the right thing. Right. Mm -hmm. but you certainly want to give people the opportunity. Right? Absolutely. The opportunity to see what your ministry is all about. Wow. That's awesome, George. I really appreciate you uh, saying that today because you brought a very uh, valid point out, you know, because our ministries do need the visibility and people are, you know, wanting to know what you have to offer. Um, you know, is it family oriented? You know, do you have a place that my youth can go? You know, uh, you know, what are the what are the things that your church is doing? You know, so I definitely, you know, agree that our churches do need to be a little bit more visible and certainly, certainly uh, let people know what you have to offer. And so that is 30 days, build a church in 30 days or grow your ministry in 30 days. Sorry about that. So you guys, listen, we're going to go ahead and take a commercial break and we'll be right back. There's nothing better than being inspired and renewed daily by the power of God. In Morning Tea with the King, author Tish Barnhart shares inspiration through a 90-day devotional that will rejuvenate your mind with scripture and your body with daily suggested herbal teas. You'll begin to see that every experience brings about a different perspective on how to view the things that are happening in our lives as we continue on our journey. Available at Amazon, your local bookstore, or at Trilogy.tv. Looking for fun, laughter, and the best show on television that supports historically black colleges and universities? Well, look no further. The HBCU Alumni House Party has got you covered. Hosted by none other than Anthony Brown. 
The HBCU Alumni House Party uplifts, talks about, and reports all things HBCU. Great guests, great subject matter, and lots of fun. You can find the HBCU Alumni House Party on the Daily Gospel Network at 6.30 p.m. on Sundays, the Daily Gospel Network International Tuesday at 10.30 a.m. Eastern, and the Daily Gospel Network Plus at 4.30 p.m. on Thursdays, all on Roku, Amazon Fire, and Apple TV. Part-time job, full-time hustle, all-time shiro to all of us. You nurture, we listen. You teach, we thrive. You lift our spirits, but we've got to lay down the truth. It's time for you, our Shiro, to stretch for the stars. A free online chat can give you the personalized tips you need to start boosting your retirement savings today. Start saving more for retirement so you can feel prepared and live your life to the fullest. Visit aceyourretirement.org. Welcome back to the show, everybody. We are speaking tonight with CEO and founder of Daily Gospel Network, George Sanders. So, George, I wanted to ask you this. Now, you have been continuously building, of course, on this awesome organization. And uh, before the pandemic, of course, you, well, during the pandemic, you started that um, Grow Your Ministry in 30 Days. And so you didn't stop there. So now we have a talk show academy. So I want you to talk to us about this talk show academy, George. What is it? Is it free? Does it cost? I mean, talk to us about the talk show academy. Well, it is free. Right. Um, before we charge a very nominal um, mm -hmm. price. And so now we, we want to just give everybody an opportunity to take advantage of this. And, and what inspired us to do this was the Daily Gospel Network has been mostly churches, mm -hmm. mostly ministry leaders. And we've had people write us in, email us and say, hey, I'd love to be on the Daily Gospel Network. Mm -hmm. I have something to say. I just don't know how to format it. I don't know. Where would I start? What, how do I record? How do I, what, where would I get it to you? How would I get it to you? And so what we did, we, we, uh, put together a, uh, course. It is a 12 week course. Mm -hmm. Um, we pride ourselves on you being able to create a show, even in the first training, in the first mm -hmm. organization, you can actually put together a show. But what we did was we put this comprehensive, uh, course together that will teach literally anybody, regardless of, you know, you may not have any film, camera, television experience whatsoever. <laughs> it, might, it might be the first time you ever picked up, whether it was an iPhone or a webcam or whatever. Yes. <laughs> you can actually go into the talk show academy and then uh, actually produce a talk show. Uh, in fact, you know, we, we have people that that are like the Tish Barnhart's of the world. That uh -huh. have, <laughs> have something to say and that, you know, I, I, you know, I joke and I say this all the time. Most people have been doing their own talk show for their whole life. They just mm -hmm. haven't been doing it, right? Mm -hmm. And so now we just give you the platform and the know-how to do it. And we have in the last, uh, since October of last year, I think late September, early October, we've had over a thousand people sign up for the talk show. Academy. Wow. That is absolutely impressive because you know I came on in August of last year. Mm -hmm. And so I remember whenever I got the invite to, um, you know, take a look at what you guys had to offer. I was like, well, hey, I don't have a church, but, you know, I would like to do a talk show. You know, can I do that? And so George was like, sure, you can do a talk show. And, you know, I had no idea, you know, where to start. I was like, okay, well, maybe I'll just do this on Facebook Live or something like that. And it was nobody but God for you to just drop in my inbox with, um, you know, the marketing. And that's why I call you a marketing genius. Okay. <laughs> Because it reeled me right on in. But, you know, I, like many people that are viewing us today, um, didn't have the experience. I didn't know the first thing about film. I didn't know the first thing about, uh, you know, shooting anything, you know. And there's still a lot of technical things, you know, that I need to learn. As my producer tells me, you need to, you might need a training course in this, Tish. <laughs> I love Anthony. He just tells the truth. And hey, I'm not mad at him because I do. I do need some training in some areas. But uh, this is one of the things that if um, people 
want to have a talk show, they can come to the academy. And I'm telling you, it is going to be simply amazing. You're going to learn so many different things in there that you would have never thought about. I mean, a kid could do it, you know, and that's one thing I say, too, about your trainings and your courses, George, is that um, you make it to where one can get it. You know what I mean? And it's not that hard to follow. And that was one of the things that I love too, uh, going through some of the trainings with you is that there was examples, you know, um, you would share your screen, you know, to be able to show us where to go and what to push. And, you know, so there was no guesswork really with it. And so I know whenever I'm reading uh, instructions for something, you know, I might still have a couple of questions about what I just read. (laughs) And so it was good that you had the question and answer, you know, period two, that period People could ask questions and get some clarity on things. And so I really enjoyed that. I really enjoyed that, George. And so um, uh, what a thousand people. Yeah. Yeah. One of the things that when, you know, you guys, (laughs) what I like to call the Tish Barnhart and the Anthony Brown Uh that that came through. um, Well, I got to give Anthony a shout out because. Yes. When I was, you know, figuring out a lot of this stuff, he came through with a certain uh, level of expertise and understanding. On yes, he does. That that even I said, OK, wow, I, did, I didn't know it had these type of functions and so on and so mm-hmm. forth. He and I have had plenty of time to kind of work on some things that were that are beneficial for for the academy that makes mm-hmm. it easier. So what, we, we we made a very conscious effort to say, OK, we're going to make this really easy to do. And I like mm-hmm. I said, brag on that on the first orientation, you can actually start creating a talk show from the first deal. And we wanted to make it inexpensive. Mm-hmm. Right. So, so when we talk about equipment, you're not going out and having to invest thousands of dollars. Right. right. You actually have a package where you can actually, um, you know, get kind of the same setup that, that you're seeing that I have here for, mm-hmm. for less in 150 175 dollars and mm-hmm. literally start your own um, talk show so we, we made a very conscious effort to do that and so but but again i have a joke that you guys class was kind of like our guinea pig we just had kinda, <laughs> are, are we making this too difficult are we making it you know are we just right and so but we've had a lot of people out of that class create some mm-hmm. awesome, when i say awesome talk shows um, like I said, you guys already had it in you. You just needed the mm-hmm. platform and just the know-how to do it. And, and right. we've had, we've seen some really, really incredible stuff come out of that. Absolutely. I'm telling you, it, I have watched a couple of shows, too, and I'm just simply amazed at, you know, what the people of God are doing and uh, even, you know, the content, the the subject matter, you know, that is coming through uh, these shows. So I definitely am um, so appreciative of you just opening it up to us to have this platform to be able to do our talk show on it, because, you know, initially, you know, when I came on, there was a lot of ministries that were, you know, showcasing their ministries and things. And that's great, you know, but I just didn't have one. So I was like, well, hey, I want to do something a little different. Can we do this? And, you know, here we are, you know, and uh, just to see how it has flourished, you know, over uh, just the past couple of months, you know, is simply, simply amazing. It's like talk shows are popping up everywhere. And so definitely, um, you guys, if you have not caught, um, you know, the HBCU alumni show, let's sit with Anthony Brown. You've got to check that show out. Uh, Of course, he's in the background here. So y'all can't see him, but hey, he is back. And so he's on the look, he's he's behind us, yeah. He's behind you, but he's (laughs) yeah. Look, he made us, he made an appearance without an appearance, right? (laughs) Wow, and wow, (laughs) well, that's outstanding, George. So, listen, also, one other thing that you were teaching us was how to create a six figure TV show as well as podcast, and so there is a training course for that, right? Yep, yeah. So we, we go a little bit, a lot more in depth, not a little bit, but, but you know, really how to monetize your show, you know, because mm-hmm. it's one thing to be able to create your show and mm-hmm. it's great that you're getting a message out and you're, you're inspiring people, you're motivating uh, your viewers, but what's wrong with you being able to, you know, create a revenue stream from mm-hmm. your talk show? After all, it is how television operates. So we show people how to take 
you know, first and foremost, you got to have a really great show. You got to polish your show. So we teach you about formatting your show, how to create it, and then how to, you know, have something that people will engage with. You know, that's, mm -hmm. hey, that looks professional, right? Like the Tish Barnhart show. Now, Thank from you. there, when you grow your audience, well, that audience is a platform for businesses, organizations, and even people to 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 get exposure. So imagine mm -hmm. a business that wants to grow their business and let more people know about their their services and the products that they offer. Imagine them saying, hey, you know, uh, Tish Barnhart has a listening audience that I can um, take advantage of. I have an opportunity mm -hmm. to put my products in front of these people. And in exchange for that, they're willing to pay for that. So right. we teach you how to approach people. We teach first, we teach you how to grow your show, right? Because that's important. If you don't have the audience, well, then it's going to be hard pressed to really ask for the monetary exchange for that. Mm -hmm. right? So Absolutely. you want to make sure that, that you, you've got a great show. And then now you, you're reaching out to business owners and we show you how to do that. And we have people that are selling commercials, having mm -hmm. sponsors and doing really well and earning a terrific income with their talk show. Wow. Absolutely. There you guys have it. Listen, you can get this free academy. You need to go get in there, okay, and learn what you need to learn so that you can spark your own show and actually create a substantial income doing so. So listen, we're going to go ahead and take another commercial break and we'll be right back with more. For those of us raised in the church, the life of a first lady looks glamorous. She is always out front with her husband and people admire her in every way imaginable. The notoriety, fame, and fortune of these men can be intoxicating to those who do not have it and some will do anything to achieve it. Little do they know that the real life of a first lady is far from perfect. Pre-order your copy today at www.tishbarnhart.com. Looking for inspiration, motivation, and the good news of Jesus Christ? Look no further. The Daily Gospel Network has what you need. With more than 300 ministries from all over the country broadcasting every week, you're sure to get your dose of spirit-filled encouragement from the great programs on the Daily Gospel Network. Catch the Daily Gospel Network on Roku, Amazon Fire, Apple TV, all mobile devices, and the internet. My graduation was something I will never forget. People like you and me sometimes may have doubts in yourself, but I feel that everything's possible. Find free adult education classes near you at finishyourdiploma.org. Hey, welcome back to the show, everybody. Listen, we have been honored to have uh, the CEO and founder of Daily Gospel Network with us, George Sanders. We've been talking to him about what inspired him to start this wonderful network and seeing all the great things that he has done um, through this whole process. And so, George, I have got another question for you, sir. So after all of this stuff that we've talked about here, what is next? on the horizon for Daily Gospel Network? Well, we are in the process of uh, working on 100 new networks, right? And hey. so, yeah, and so this is, we've been working on this for the past six months. And um, what we wanna do is, is create a more of a, a local feel. Mm -hmm. uh, so we want to plant, if you will, networks in the local markets. Um, and so we've got a hundred uh, destinations uh, pinpointed and we start those uh, 
this month coming up. So um, we're going to have, you know, 15 a month. And our goal is by the end of the year that we will have uh, 100 networks. And the, the whole premise of it is to really give our broadcasting partners an opportunity to be in their own backyard, right? Mm -hmm. So that they can reach out to local advertisers, local organizations, and be able to create this relationship with them uh, so that they can get more exposure. And then you have this uh, synergy with businesses, talk show hosts, talk shows, uh, as well as, you know, local organizations. And so we're able to help the, the local market grow and we're able to help our broadcasting partners, you know, earn revenue. So we're, we're looking at uh, finishing about 100 by the end of the year. And so wow. we're really, really, really excited about that. And it's a huge undertaking. Uh, I'm sure it is. <laughs> but, you know, we're, we're ready to do it. Wow, George, that is so awesome. A hundred networks for some local areas. And I understand Charlotte is going to be Absolutely. one of them. Yep. <laughs> and Anthony has twisted my arm. No, he hasn't. Uh, <laughs> Cleveland was already on the list. Uh, we, what we try to do is get large, met, larger metropolitan areas. Mm -hmm. so obviously, Charlotte was on the list. Cleveland was on the list. And so, um, we're, I mean, we're, we're enthused about it because it's just going to be... Um, you know, family uh, entertainment. Mm -hmm. We're going to even have movies working our deals right now where yes. we're buying licensing for movies. So it's just going to be uh, a full deal. So if you, you know, it's going to all family friendly now. And all uh, right. we're excited. We're excited. All right. Good deal. Well, listen, you guys, we have been talking with George Sanders, the CEO and founder of Daily Gospel Network. Listen, I want you guys to stay tuned with us. Join us again on next week. Look, 30 days to uh, growing your church, the talk show academy training. Listen, all of that wrapped up in one. And so I want to thank you again, George, for uh, coming on tonight. We definitely appreciate you and certainly the Tish Barnhart show. We honor you tonight. I'm telling you, I tilt my hat off to you, sir. Awesome job. Thanks a lot, everybody. Goodbye. Now. Looking for inspiration, motivation, and the good news of Jesus Christ? Look no further. The Daily Gospel Network has what you need. With more than 300 ministries from all over the country broadcasting every week, you're sure to get your dose of spirit-filled encouragement from the great programs on the Daily Gospel Network. Catch the Daily Gospel Network on Roku, Amazon Fire, Apple TV, all mobile devices, and the internet. Thanks for tuning in to the Tish Barnhart Show. We pray that you were motivated, inspired, and blessed. Tune in next week for another great segment as we bring you thought-provoking topics, great guests, and tons of encouragement. Until next time, remember, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me.